Extra 1360, Fox Sports San Diego. One thing I take away from uh, yesterday's postgame interview with Philip Rivers, he's your leader. When he says he's a loss for words with the way they've lost another game, what's that say? Well, they, they've lost such heartbreaking games. Down to the wire, and they have yet to find a way to get over that last obstacle. He doesn't, I mean, what are you going to say? It's heartbreaking. The season seemingly is over at this point. Of the way they've lost the games so close, does that say anything about the way they're playing? Or The hard thing at this point is they've been so injured and wounded that now you've got a lot of backups in who should not be seeing as much playing time as they are. And I like to say there's no horses in the stable. They don't have the playmakers they need on the field to win these games. What's one fact headed into the Monday night game against the Bears? Their 2-1-5 is establishing something early on. Is that something we could lean toward? Well, you've got an opportunity to establish the run this week. The last several games we've been playing top 10 defenses against the run. This week, Chicago is bottom of the barrel against the run. So you got the opportunity to get that going. I'd love to see Phillip Rivers under center, Melvin Gordon in the dot behind him with options to run either way, put him in a good position physically and mentally. Something that he's used to and that he's succeeded with in the past is quarterback under center, give me the ball, let me have some cutback lanes. They've got an opportunity to do it. We'll see if they take it. All right, that's Nick's Hard Facts with Nick's Hardwick at SportsSD.com.